Hey mama. Do you ever get a little stressed out, a little overwhelmed, and then start having wild thoughts? Like, maybe I should just buy new clothes instead of doing the laundry. I know what that's like. And it's no wonder that sometimes we have these thoughts because we're doing a lot. We're doing the most a lot of days, right? We are raising kids, we're killing it at work, we are being good daughters, we're being good partners, we're trying to help improve the world, and like it can get overwhelming. And that overwhelm can turn into stress that you don't always feel, it kind of just creeps up, you know, like the frog in the water analogy where the water gets hot and the frog doesn't realize it, just kind of creeps up. And then one day you're like, you know what? I think I might just throw these plates away instead of washing them because I'm just done. I'm done and this is what we need to do, right? Those are not good thoughts. And so when I find myself in that place, I realize that usually I'm a little disconnected, my mind and my body and a little overwhelmed. And what helps me to get through that is yoga. And I'm not talking anything acrobatic. I am talking about just for 10 minutes, sometimes seven, depending, seven to 10 minutes, moving my body, breathing and moving my body. A little downward dog, a little cat cow, child's pose, thread the needle, which is kind of like child's pose where you put your arm through. That really seems to help me reconnect. And when I have those wild thoughts, I do this as soon as possible, whether it's between meetings, or when the kids are outside, I just take a moment and do a little bit of yoga. And it really helps me to start to make better decisions, have healthier thoughts, and be the person that I wanna be, right? It stops me from going, I'm gonna throw these dishes away, to saying something like, maybe next time we use paper plates because I am a little over washing dishes, right? Doing a little bit of yoga helps me to reconnect, and if you haven't tried it, go ahead and try it. I think you'll find that it also helps you to be the woman that you want to be. If you like this advice and you wanna hear more advice for working moms, please go ahead and check out my podcast, The Savvy Working Mom, wherever you listen to podcasts, Spotify, iTunes, wherever you find them, The Savvy Working Mom is there. Hey mama, if you like what you just heard, I'm now offering VIP days where we can work together to help you thrive in and out of the office. Come check it out on my website, The Savvy Working Mom.